Hey guys, it's I Want a Turtle, and it's better late than never, I guess, or I hope. Uh, we finally got our boxes of Ravnica Allegiance. Um, a little late to the party, but I'm very excited to crack open into this uh, box. It's the first new set that we've opened on the channel where like it just came out. So let's do this. Uh, so compared to other videos where we did it in three different parts, we'll do this one in two. So we'll do 18, 18 per video and just struggling with the box and there we go. Looks great. So it should be 12, and the 6, and we'll start with that. All right, very cool. I do like the blue of the packs. All right, so the thing we're looking for, the Hydro Crisis, the Hydra, the Hydra of all things, it's kind of surprising still. That would be the big hit that we're looking for. These were here. Okay, we got Borak Clan Crusher, Sentinel's Mark, Orzov Enforcer, and then for our first rare, we have a, one of the dual cards, Bedek and Bedazzle. All right. How are you guys liking the set so far? Um, I feel like overall, it's a little underwhelming, but the, the Shocklands are always like a huge plus. Uh, a lot of those, it seems like none of them are like over $10, but they're pretty, very solid rares. Although, as far as like the set goes, it, it makes it valuable, but doesn't make this set exciting. So we have an Immolation Shaman, and then a Screaming Shield Foil. This card is so, so strange. I, just, I think the art is so funny. The guy just looks very annoyed. All right, first foil, and it is an uncommon. I feel like equipments are very rare, that equipments are great. So we got that Screaming Shield again, a Carnival and Carnage. Blood Mist Infiltrator, I do like that art. Looks like the guy just like walks right through the bars. And then, Clans of the Guild Pack. All right. Okay, we got a Gateway Sneak. Dire Engineer. Sphinx of the Guild Pack for seven. So all colors, hexproof from mono colored. And our first mythic, Rakdos the Showstopper. Eh. Not, not very exciting. I'll just take a look at this card real quick. Uh, so we got a 6-6 six, six for 6. Uh, Rakdos Showstopper has flying trample, enters the battlefield with a coin for each creature card that isn't a demon. And demon, devil, or imp destroy that creature. Okay, so it's like a, for each creature, it's like a 50% to destroy them. Feels like a, feels like a battle bond card. All right, Biogenic Upgrade, Syndicate Guild Mage, and then the Street Dodger with a Mirror March. Oh, we do have a foil, Blade Juggler. I think another card that I'm really looking for was, is the Prime Speaker. Basically the Creature Birthing Pod. Because I did, that was a card that I very much enjoyed in um, New Phyrexia. All right, we got Clamor Shaman, Collision and Colossus, the Street Dodger, and Gutter Bones, a one drop. Enters the battlefield tapped, Gutter Bones from your graveyard into your hand. Activate this ability on your turn, and only if your opponent loses life this turn. Okay, that, that card sounds pretty good. Let's 
simple card. Like, useful, but not overpowered. Alright, Senate Guild Mage, Sentinel's Mark, Smelt Ward Ingus, and Deer of Horrors. Ooh, another foil. Bellisca Bell Hunt. Alright, so I feel like so far, nothing crazy. Haven't hit any any Shocklands, any Great Mythics. To be honest, I'm not familiar with uh, how this one's doing. But we got a Sharkto Crab. Sounds like something from a terrible, bad sci-fi movie. Dagger Caster. Scrambling Claws. With a Judith the Scourge Diva. Cool, that one's like a six dollar, I think. I think we're about halfway through, and I would say we kind of have like a hit, maybe two. Some stuff I'm maybe not completely familiar with. Consecrate and Consume, Pumander, Terra, Terramander, Macabre Mockery, yes. First shock land, we got the Godless Shrine, white black. All right, next pack, we got a Archway Angel, Mortify, Spire Mangler, and a Cinder Vines. Let's see, for a red and a green, if you want to catch a non creature spell, deals one damage to that player. Sacrifice to destroy target artifact and enchantment. Huh, I feel like that's. Oh, I actually I didn't realize this was an enchantment. That's. Doesn't seem terrible. I see that being a thing for a burn deck. Alright, Sunder Shaman, Cult Guild Mage, Tower Defense, and then Lavina, Lavinia, Zorius Renegade. Okay, Urzov Rocketeers, High Alert. Gates ablaze. X damage to each creature where X is number of gates you control. And then awaken the erstwhile. Hmm. Alright, I think we're, we're due for our next mythic, I think. Alright, Silhana so Wayfinder. Azorius Skyguard. Drill bit, that card. Cool art. Then Unbreakable Formation. Ooh. Okay. Rally to Battle. Hacrobat. Junk Troller. And then a Lumbering Battlement. We do have foil, plague, plague white. All right, Sunder Shaman again. Eyes everywhere. Macabre mockery, and then a Nikia the old ways. Thrilled Mystic, Incubation in Incongruity, Regenesis, Grow Chamber Guardian. Okay, pretty good. All right, for Adapt 2, uh, for 3, 
And then when what more plus one plus one counters are put on Growth Chamber Guardian, you may search your library for a card named Growth Chamber Guardian and put it into your hand. Kind of, it's uh, basically you adapt them, then you get more of them. Kind of tutors himself. So pretty good. Sphinx. Light up the stage. Knight of the Last Breath. Ooh, another door card. Thrash and Threat. I think those cards are never that good. All right, last pack for our first opening. All right, we only got one Mythic so far, so we're definitely due for another one. Mortify, Clan Guild Mage, then Tome of the Guild Pack. Whenever you cast a multicolored spell, draw a card, add one mana to any color. Doesn't sound that bad, except for it costs five. That's way expensive. All right, so that was the first part of our first box. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Please drop a like on the video if you enjoyed the content. Uh, subscribe for future videos. We're gonna continue opening uh, these for at least a little bit. So if you are enjoying it, definitely subscribe, and there'll be plenty more of these videos. Other than that, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.